getting ready to leave and the aim is to leave before sunrise that's some of the stuff which is going in there it's camping equipment our food sleeping gear cycling gear two bicycles for three days for 4,000 kilometers. Like all this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot more coming. This aeroplane is like a tool for living. Especially here in Africa where there's lots of space and sunrises like this. It's the most fantastic tool to go and see what the world has to offer. I love the start of a new adventure. This is the reef. We're going to cross court. Monati, Belansberg, Ochrabi, Spernierkpan, Stenabosch, Capigalas, Port Elizabeth, Wavecrest, Kwasi, Destiny Castle. Anyway, we've got a hell of a long way to go. This is lovely countryside, this is Pumalanga. Hey? You know what a Pumalanga means? No. The rising sun. Puma Ilanga, the sun rises. What language is that? It's in Zulu. Zulu. You need to learn to speak Zulu, my man. You're married to a Zulu. <laughs> <laughs> but I know the importance of it. Looks like an aeroplane. One right down. Okay. That's for sure, the runway is cut. Province number two? Uh, I don't know, man. Yeah. I think we are province number three, actually. I think we can count Gauteng. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I rode I 10 meters so, yeah. this morning. Yeah. <laughs> I pushed my bicycle around the <laughs> of quite a long day celebrating Heritage Day. There actually is little greater pleasure I think than sitting around a fire. It speaks to some kind of prime evil urge, yeah? And knowing that tomorrow you're gonna fly six or seven hours, ride for at least two and a half. Ranko, what time is it? Uh six o'clock huh? Starting to run late. And like usual. <laughs> <laughs> we uh, we fly to Fernyukpan. And my little mission is to make a cup of coffee and then ride 10 kilometers and see if we can do it on a route that doesn't rise or fall one single meter because the water on those pans acts like a spirit level. Let's go. This is a Garmin Edge 850, and our total ascent in 10 <laughs> kilometers is zero meters. Even Branko can ride on a surface like this. Now, the main reason I wear a helmet is not really to protect my head, it's to protect myself from criticism. Southern tip of Africa. Protected by the most southernmost lighthouse in Africa. I'll tell you what, what I am worried about is where we're going to sleep tonight. Because I do not think we're going to get to Wave Crest, even in this wind. But if we don't, 
You'll find somewhere to stop. Branka, 15 minutes out. We're going to go under the uh, stones of a bridge, okay? Yeah, okay. You, uh, you want me to land and take you out first? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're giving me fright since we started. <laughs> Welcome our second last ride. These are in Afrikaans the Drakensberg, the Dragon's Mountains, and in Zulu Ukatamba, the Barrier of Spears. Yeah! How beautiful is that, Kana? That's it! The last stop! 